Okay, welcome back everybody. Welcome to episode two of my Let's Play. Let's play Space Quest 3. So we're up to, we've just escaped the junkyard and now, all right, so we're in the Aluminum Mallard and it's time to figure out where we're gonna head off to next. So we, as you can see on screen, you are here. We are in the middle of absolutely nowhere. So we're gonna press one to scan for somewhere more interesting, more fun hopefully to visit. All right, this, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, this volcanic uh, planet where I think should be done last if I'm not mistaken so we're gonna keep scanning scan 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 uh, yeah. All right. I think flea butt or flea butt get a flea butt is uh, the next ideal place to go so we're gonna set course for flea butt stand by calculating course force locked and five for ludicrous speed. No, only light speed. That is, of course, uh, that was my reference to Space Qu uh, Space Balls, one of my all-time favorite movies. It's like the this reminds me of the classic Windows um, uh, screensaver. Oh, and who do we have here? We are being followed, uh, boys and girls. I identity confirmed. Roger Wilco case whatever. See, I can barely read forwards, you know, the normal way. Now they're forcing me to read backwards. But that's cool because I, I've actually, as I've said before, I think, I've played this game several times, so I know why, why he's after us. Um, basically because um, I think he's actually going to tell us later on once he captures us, so I'll leave it for him to describe what's going on. To tell us what's going on. All right, so we're here, orbiting planet Fleeb Hut, and three to land. Okay, well, basically, in the previous space quest, Roger uh, bought a uh, whistle, a mating whistle, didn't pay for it, and now authorities are after him, and they have sent this uh, Terminator. They have sent Arnold, who might have won't be set the aluminum mallard down on the surface of Fleeb Hut. <coughs> Excuse me. And I still do have a cold. So bear with me. Stand. Exit. Alright, we can either press we can either type exit or press the red button. As you step out of your out of your ship onto the surface of onto the pink sand of flea but you are hit in the face by the harsh winds. It looks like a storm is brewing. Ooh. Meanwhile, another spacecraft touches touches down elsewhere on I wasn't done reading that. Damn it, <laughs> I really should slow it down. I think you can't can. wait. I'll try it later. Who do we have here? It's Arnold the Terminator himself with his sexy underwear. Look at him, checking himself out. No, no, he's not. He's pressing his red invisibility belt. We'll have to remember that for later because later on we need to take that belt from him. And not in a sexual, creepy way. We, we're going to we're gonna kill him first and then take his belt, which totally doesn't sound creepy at all. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need that belt, and that's that. You, you don't you don't really have to know how we're gonna do it yet. We have to be careful. There are scorpions that roam around this planet, so we gotta have to keep our an eye out for that. Don't don't I'm trying not to die. There is also um. On one screen, if we go the wrong way, oh, there we go. Spe speaking of the scorp scorpizoid, to be exact. Uh, let's just exit the screen and go back. There's also, oh no! No! Oh damn, that was so close. Uh, okay, that's cool. Because we haven't even saved, so <laughs> I would have had to restart all the way back to the, to the ship. Now this part here actually took me a while as a kid. Um, because... I always try to avoid this uh, this giant monster, which isn't really a giant monster, so I didn't really know what to do on this planet. But it turns out you actually have to go towards a giant monster. Well, because it's only a souvenir shop. Well, that's my phone. That's totally off. Right, okay. Aliens come. And it's World of Wonders. Welcome to World of Wonders. 
It's, a, it's the one and only souvenir shop. It's the one and only shop on the entire planet, I think. Howdy, stranger. The name's Blatz. Faster Blatz. Welcome to World Wonders. Go ahead and have a look at some of the trendiest items in the in the known universe. Make the most of your vacation buckazoid, which we don't have any of. But, fortunately, we do have a glowing gem, which, if you look at the bottom of the screen, it looks exactly like our gem. <coughs> Excuse me. So, therefore, that means our gem is actually worth something. So, let's sell it to him. Ooh. Very intrigued. Mama, that certainly is one fine hunk of Orion. Yeah, how big his eyes went. Even bigger than they already were. I'll take it off your hands for 350 buckazoids. What you say? No, we're gonna haggle. Now that we have to, I don't think I think 350 is actually enough for the entire game. But because we can haggle for more, and I think this is the maximum we can get, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Get 425. So uh, what's that? 75 buckazoids more. How about a nice or add on a stick? Oh, take buy, buy all right. Basically, we have to buy anything he advertises to us. Well, most things. All right. Yep. Kids will love blah blah blah. Now here's a red hot, red hot item: the official Astro Chicken Flight Hat. Okay. Buy a hat. This one we don't really need. I think for points though. You don the jaunty hat, and you feel more sporty already. All right, so we got the hat. Going to any high temp planets? Yes, we will later on. This nice pair of thermal weave underwear will keep your internal environment pleasant on even the sweatiest world. So we're gonna take underwear. And here you'll have to try. okay buy underwear. Botanic game. A wise choice. I'm sure you'll be very, very pleased. I think that's all we need. We can look at all the. Of the uh, uh, postcards, they're quite hilarious, hilarious some of them, but um, <coughs> excuse me, um, yeah, we don't have time. I, uh, I want to, <laughs> want to try and just get to the point, keep my video short, short and to the point, short and sweet, or short anyway. Uh, I think that's all we need. Okay, let's have a look. All right, or at on a stick. I used to love these when I was a kid. Not. Exactly the aura. I never had an aura. I had like superheroes. I think yeah, they're awesome um, I mean in real life. Yeah, not that on the game uh, Thermal weave. Uh, okay, we got that. Yeah, so the chicken flight hat Reminds me of the movie the duck from the movie Howard the duck another one of my all-time favorites Buckazoids we have 350 left of these nifty monetary units Known as Buckazoids. In Space Ghost 4, the Buckazoids actually look like Bitcoin, which is pretty prophetic, I think. And that is it for now. Just feel, just take your time. You're here. Don't feel pressured to buy anything, even though you're trying to sell me everything. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, it looks like that lightning is getting close. Better be careful out there. Okay. Whoa. Uh oh. We're dead. We're dead. Game over. I forgot to save. Hi, right, kid. Is it actually supposed to happen? You can't avoid it. Look at Roger. He's like, oh, I wonder what he's trying to say. So, this is Roger Wilco, the man I've been sent across the universe to track down and dominate. Yeah, the worst Arnie impersonation ever. I think you forgot to pay for that. Maybe I'll tell Yeah, All right. So, in the previous Space Quest, he bought this Roger. I ordered, he didn't buy it, he ordered this Levon Ter Terror Beast mating call whistle, that's a long name. And he didn't pay for it, now author authorities have sent this Terminator, Arnie, Arnold, to um, get Roger and terminate him. If you make it, alright, so he will count to 10 real slow, and then he'll track us down. So he's going to give us a, sp a sporting chance to get away, which is good. And 10 seconds is all we need. Now, this part here, there are two ways of, uh, of killing the, or destroying the Terminator. Like, that's the only way uh, to escape him. You can't run away from him. He'll always catch you. So we'll, we'll have to destroy him. 
this way that now I'm going to do is actually the easier way. So yeah, because why do it the harder way unless you're doing like a long player or a review or something? And why do it the harder way when there isn't a much much easier and quicker way? Because the other way is not only harder but it's actually a lot. I, 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 sorry, it actually takes a lot longer. All right, so we go up here. Yeah, so what we're gonna do is see that see those gears, those two gears. We're gonna try and um, push him into those gears using this hook that um, that we're gonna push into him. If that makes any sense. All right, here it comes. We have, I think we have to time it. Right, uh, we're gonna push hook. Hopefully, I'm in the right position. Reaching up, you give the rope pulley a mighty shove. Yeah! Perfect timing. Beautiful. And yes, you can die if you get too close to it, so we're not going to... I made sure we were... I was as low as possible. Alright, so... Look. Terminator. The Terminator is now a pile of junk on the first level platform. Looking closely, you notice that the Terminator's invisibility belt has survived relatively intact so yeah now we take the belt we don't even the other way to do it um, was to get him to walk under this giant plant that sucks anything that walks under it and, and if we did did it that way yeah hang on just hold that thought hey what's going on here didn't you read the sign saying we're closed for repairs oh, oops. well you might as well ride down with me yeah the other way we needed this uh, the aura on a stick because otherwise the the giant plant uh, that eats whatever walks under it would eat us as well okay all right that part's done let's have a quick look we can go back up no uh, forget it i don't want to waste too much video time i just want to get to the point yeah so yeah, we have to find, or try, try and remember, oh, are we dead enough? But <laughs> we have to try and remember where we parked. It's kind of like after shopping, you have to remember where you parked. Oh, actually, we did shop. We bought several things. Several items that we didn't even, we're never even going to use. There's that lightning. That lightning can actually kill us. So thank God we didn't go that way. There it is. Oh, asshole, no! <laughs> Sorry. Part of my French, I do cuss from time to time, but not. I don't. I try not to drop the f bomb too much, but I do say little cuss words like shit, ass. <laughs> then I just slip it out. All right, I think that's all we need. We need to do uh, um, on this planet, on the planet of flea butt. And I will do the rest in the next video. I think so. We'll see you guys then.